What is going on, guys? Welcome back to a very exciting episode of Star Wars The Old Republic Game Update 5.10.3, The Dantooine Incursion. Yes, you're reading this correctly. It was actually leaked out on Reddit a couple days ago. I believe it was actually leaked out on April Fool's Day, and that's why I didn't really think too much of it, because it was April Fool's, but it seems that the leaked information on Dantooine is indeed correct. The developers over at Star Wars The Old Republic have officially confirmed it today, uh, basically stating that the Dantooine Incursion is going to be the next upcoming brand new in-game event. Now this is actually something really interesting. It's going to be a brand new daily area, I believe. So let's go ahead and jump on in and read more information about this. Now, unfortunately, we don't have too much information, so I do apologize for that. But there's really nothing we can really do at this point. Game update 5.10.3, the Dantooine Incursion, has been announced. The Dantooine Incursion introduces a new in-game event set on the planet Dantooine. This limited-time event will join the rotation of other recurring events in Star Wars The Old Republic, such as the Ragal Reassurance and Relics of the Gree. It seems they also missed out on Bounty Brokers Association, but I'm sure it's... Anyway. With the renewed war... Is that right? Yes. With the renewed war between the Galactic Republic and the Sith Empire, the remote planet Dantooine has taken on a sudden significance. Its location at the edge of the Imperial space makes it a perfect start staging area for Republic military ships traveling to and from the front lines. Unable to breach the Republic lines and attack the planet directly, the agents of the Empire have recruited the brutal Nova Blade pirates to attack Dantooine from within the Republic's own territory, catching the planet's defenders completely off guard with the overwhelming violence of their attack. Now it's interesting we're seeing the return of Nova Blade pirates. If you guys recall, Nova Blade pirates were introduced during the Battle of Rishi update, expansion, whatever you want to call it. So it's definitely going to be interesting to see what they're doing on Dantooine. In the, ens in the ensuing chaos, forgive me if I pronounced that incorrectly, elite Imperial forces have infiltrated Dantooine and established a hidden base on the planet's surface, aiming to cripple the Republic's effort with a series of surgical strikes. The Nova Blades lash out at anyone and everyone they can find, despite originally being hired by the Empire. This brutal pirate armada cares only for the plunder they can claim. Staggering by the pirate's ruthlessness and the Empire's cunning, the Republic's harried, or harried defenders put on a call for assistance from anyone who can help them hold Dantooine against the enemy's deadly incursions. That's pretty much the only information that we have. That's literally just a big tease. Um... But I am excited <clears throat> for what it says below. Look for more information about Game Update 5.10.3 to Dantooine Incursion in April 2019. We're already in April. So I'm assuming within the next week or two, we'll have a bunch more information on the Dantooine Incursion, considering Star Wars Celebration is, I think, next week or the week after. So I'm really hoping to hear some <clears throat> new information about this. Now, the only thing that really, really gets me disappointed is it's a limited time event. So, if you guys recall, pretty much every event that we've had, the uh, Radical Reassurance, the Relics of the Gree, uh, Bounty Brokers Association, um, I could have sworn there was another one. But anyway, <clears throat> all those events had reputation, all those events had rewards that you could obtain and purchase, etc. With the Dantooine Incursion, I really, really hope that they do include reputation that we can grind. I do hope they include brand new rewards such as outfits, decorations, mounts, etc. I do hope that they introduce that as well in this update. Uh, so it'll give us players something new to grind for. However... The only thing that I'm worried about is Bioware will more than likely only put this, only release this for like a whole week. Knowing how fucking lazy they are, they will more than likely do that. Because each event, I think each event except for the Gree, I'm not entirely sure, is one week only. And I think the Gree is two weeks. 
Could be wrong, but regardless, I really do hope once this update releases, it'll at least be a couple weeks long for everyone to get their hands on and experience Dantooine at its finest, I guess. But um, aside from that, though, I really am super excited to see the release of Dantooine. When do I think this update will hit? Probably not until uh, late April, maybe early May. As much as I hate to say early May because I'm really excited for this, like I, I want this update to hit now. <laughs> um, you know, however long it takes, as long as it's not like fucking two months away. Um, my, my personal opinion, though, I, I believe it'll be it'll probably release maybe early May, at least. I'm not entirely sure. But if we're lucky, the event will go on the PTS, and we'll be able to try it then. But aside from that, I really don't know. Um, I don't I don't know if we're already in 5.10.2. I believe we are, but I could be wrong. So this update might not be the next update. Um, I, I, I'm pretty sure it is, though. I do apologize. My memory is super shit. But I do believe that this is going to be the next update. I really do believe. But anyway, correct me if I'm wrong. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys are excited for, for Dantooine. For me, I'm excited for anything. I'm going to be taking a bunch of screenshots, that's for damn sure. So anyway, until then, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you guys later.